everybody. We are in the weekly Zoom meeting of uh, Israelis and Palestinians for peace. A lively regular discussion, sometimes with dozens of members participating. The problem that we don't have decision makers can decide yeah, and can make a uh, yeah, uh, uh, brave decisions. So we start the first. We started the first step to 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 create yeah, a new generation away from politics. These meetings are organized through this Facebook group, founded by peace advocate Mori Sela, who says it's the most active such community online. On Facebook, we have about 4,000 people. Uh, three of them, 3,000 of them are very active every month. Working with him is Walda Al Sada and other activists who monitor the group closely to ensure respectful dialogue. We did have quite a few people that we had to block or mute for a while until they learn what the language in this group is. And we, we sometimes call them yeah. when they make some comments that they're not respectful or has some uh, violence. It's a challenge to have Palestinians from Gaza, from uh, West Bank, from all over the world to speak about their narratives and to listen to the Israeli narratives too. And some Palestinians face a bigger hurdle. How can you operate in, in, in Gaza? How, how, uh, how much freedom do you have? What, do, what does Hamas do to keep you from doing what you try to do? Hamas arrested seven members from our group, me and other six partners. But after that, after six months, Hamas released on me because I wasn't a collaborator. This despite the fact Hamas themselves are in constant contact with Israelis. The main uh, man in Hamas called uh, Ghazi Hamad. He's a Hamas leader and he's a representative of Hamas movement. And he has a daily calls with an Israeli, an Israeli leaders or Israeli people. And I can give you some from Hamas contacts so you can speak with them, yani, and you will find a lot of welcoming from them. Yani. Don't worry about that. But maybe you will find that they don't have any kind of vision. They have nothing. Yani. Hamas and Fatah failed to make peace between them. How can they make peace with their neighbors? Other Gazans turn their focus elsewhere. We are restricted not only by occupation and siege, we are also restricted by patriarchal men as well. And disagree how to change the situation. I couldn't do anything in Gaza, of course, I couldn't. You need to be in some sort of like privilege. To make that change here, it's easy to travel to America or to Europe and speak about peace and speak about love and speak about respect. No, it's a waste of time. Israelis and Palestinians disagreeing, Palestinians and Palestinians disagreeing, but at least there is dialogue. All the time that we have the energy and the motivation, this also gives us the optimism. It's like something feed the other. And sometimes big things start with a few small steps.